Today, we will show you how to use the Garmin BlueNet 30 Gateway. The Garmin BlueNet 30 Gateway allows you to connect legacy Garmin Marine Network devices to a Garmin BlueNet chart plotter or network. This installation will allow the connected devices to communicate as one network and share information such as user data, mapping, and sonar in a manner consistent with how it was done with a legacy Garmin Marine Network. For this video, we will be using a GPS Map 8612, a GPS Map 9000 series BlueNet chart plotter, and a BlueNet 30 gateway. This gateway is designed for use only when connecting legacy Garmin Marine network devices to a Garmin BlueNet chart plotter or network. It should not be used without any Garmin BlueNet chart plotters. Connect the Garmin BlueNet 30 gateway to power through the ignition or another physical switch. The device will drain the battery if connected directly to it as it continues to draw power when the system is off. Only one Garmin BlueNet 30 gateway can be installed in a mixed network. All Garmin BlueNet network devices must connect to each other or to a Garmin BlueNet 20 switch. Only one Garmin BlueNet network device or Garmin BlueNet 20 switch may connect to the Garmin BlueNet 30 gateway. Legacy Garmin Marine network devices must connect to one another or to a GMS 10 switch. Only one legacy Garmin Marine Network device or GMS 10 switch needs to connect to the Garmin BlueNet 30 gateway to communicate with the Garmin BlueNet Network devices. First, we will connect our legacy Garmin Marine Network 8612 to the BlueNet 30 gateway. Connect a legacy Garmin Marine Network cable to a network port on the back of the chart plotter. Then connect the other end of the cable to the BlueNet 30 gateway. You can connect using either network port. Next, we will connect our 9000 series chart plotter to the BlueNet gateway with a Garmin BlueNet network cable. Finally, connect the other end of the cable to the BlueNet gateway. And that's it. Thanks for watching. For more help, please visit marinesupport.garmin.com.